Extremely disappointing, controversial late timeout angers Suns as Lakers make NBA in-season tournament semifinals, a controversial late timeout call was the main talking point following the Los Angeles Lakers' 106-103 victory over the Phoenix Suns in the NBA in-season tournament quarterfinals on Tuesday. With the Lakers leading 105-103 with approximately 10 seconds remaining, the ball was inbound to Lakers guard Austin Reeves with Suns defenders swarming him, Reeves would eventually succumb to the defensive pressure as he lost control of the ball almost simultaneously as James, standing near an official on the other side of the court, signaled for a timeout, Suns players were furious with the awarding of the timeout. With the ball appearing to not be in Reeves' possession when the whistle blew and it falling into the waiting clutches of Suns guard Grayson Allen, a gaggle of Suns players attempted to reason with the officials, while Phoenix head coach Frank Vogel also spent the break questioning why the decision was made. In the final seconds following the timeout, Anthony Davis made a free throw and Kevin Durant's last second three point attempt just missed as the Lakers held on for the victory to advance to the semi finals of the inaugural in season tournament joining the New Orleans Pelicans, Indiana Pacers, and Milwaukee Bucks. While the Lakers advanced, the Suns were left scratching their heads about the timeout call. In the post-game pool report, the crew chief for the game, Josh Tyvon, explained why the timeout was awarded to James, Booker drives to the basket